Here we are at the one month check-in for the weight loss challenge. And as of this morning, I weighed in at 189 pounds at 21.2% body fat. And that's five pounds-ish since I started this a month ago. And I am so happy to know that the progress is happening. You know, I said when I first started this that I was hoping to see results and results that mattered. And I said I was going to be ecstatic when that scale finally hit the 180 something mark again to know that it was working. I also today hit a personal best on my three mile 30-ish minute run. At 35 minutes, I was able to run the three miles. Two years ago when I first started going back to the gym, I've told the story time and time again, my mile was about 16 to 18 minutes. And it was embarrassing. It was sad to me to know how far I had fallen from where I once was. So the goals going forward, hopefully within the next month, we can do another five pounds, which will bring me down to like 184, which I'll be super happy about that. I'll be honest with you guys. Now, the diet's been going good. The exercise has been going good. I feel great. I feel a little sore today after the gym, but that's, you know, expected. Um, I want to know how you guys are doing if you've been following along on this fitness journey. If you've been doing it yourself, what are your results? Leave those down in the comment section below. Now, one of the cool things that I've noticed is just mentally I feel better, probably because I'm seeing the results I want to see. I see it in my face looking better, looking healthier. My skin is clearing up, and I don't look as bloated. I don't look as puffy. And one of the reasons I wanted to come into this video wearing the new CM Punk shirt um, wasn't to kind of promote CM Punk because, I mean, CM Punk is awesome. You guys know that. You know how much of a CM Punk fan I am. But this journey is about making me the best Glenn in the world that I've ever been. And that starts with getting me back to where I want to be, looking how I want to look, and, you know, overall just feeling great again so then I don't feel all sluggish and lazy and depressed and sad and start falling back on my dietary habits. Now when it comes to diet, I have started to allow myself some cheat meals because I've read that's good in terms of keeping your metabolism going because when you start to eat the same thing all the time, your body gets used to it and doesn't really rev up as much as it should. I don't know how true that is, but I've been trying it and I did get down to the 189, so that's cool. Um, but all in all, the first month I think has been very successful. I haven't drank. I've been eating healthy. You know, sometimes you really wish you could have that nice cold beer after a long day. But my focus is in other places at this point, and I know where I need to get. And um, hopefully by November, if the trend continues, I want to be down to maybe 179. Maybe we'll get further than that. You know, I feel like wearing this shirt, if I were to have it a month ago, my gut would be hanging out. I would look disgusting in my own mind. Um, but it's just really nice to kind of see the progress happening and happening as nice as it is. Now, I would have loved to lose that eight pounds and get down to 186, that they say losing one to two pounds a week is kind of healthy. So I'm kind of in the median point there with the five-ish pounds I've lost. But I feel great, I feel healthy. Um, I think things are gonna be beautiful going forward, especially because it's working. You know, I said one of my biggest stripes would have been if I were to look at the scale and I didn't see any results, I probably would have given up because I would have just been, all right, it's not working. What am I doing wrong? Screw all this. But it is. And, you know, it's cool. Like, whoever thought that dieting wouldn't be as stressful um, as it is, they do say diet is like 80 to 90% of the process, exercise is the other 10 to 20. So the diet has been on track. I actually have to meal prep again today at some point, but that's kind of my day. That's kind of the update I wanted to give you guys. A little quick one, you know, four or five minute video. I uh, wanted to say thank you for everyone who's watching. Thank you for everyone who's been giving me like coaching advice about what I should add to the diet, what I should try doing, what I need to do from there because without you guys, I would have no direction. Um, I can research all I want, but it was a matter of implementing it. And when I started implementing so many people's advices from like my friends, from people at the gym, it came down to seeing the results. So now I know what I can do. And now, physically, I can push myself more than I have because things just don't really hurt as much as they were. And that's kind of the cool part about it, guys. So that's my one-month check-in. Um, I want to thank everyone who's been tuning in. Leave your results down below, too, if you've been following this. Let's kind of get where we want to get together. As always, thank you for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. 
stay healthy, stay happy, stay safe is the closest and most important thing I could say. And I'll catch you later, guys. See you, bye.